Good morning, dear parents and grade 12s and the rest of the school. It's a warm welcome from a very, very cold Friday morning, the 12th. Um, dear parents, especially grade 12 parents, um, I would like today just to give you a bit of a feedback regarding what happened this first week of the return of our learners. First of all, dear parents, thank you so much for the great effort yourselves are making to drop off the learners on time every day, and especially in the afternoons. It's a very quick process and everybody is out of the gate and in the cars. I really do thank you for that. The learners are really trying their utmost best to keep social distancing. A bit of a challenge during break, of course, but we are managing that. Things are going rather well at school. And the other thing that's quite important that I have to say to the parents, I believe you were quite instrumental in making sure that our kids did their work during the lockdown. There are certain subjects which is where it's clearly evident to us that um, the learners has done a lot of work during the lockdown. One of the maths teachers said to me, he's actually now almost going into being advanced in the schedule and the work plan for the grade 12s because now that he's starting to teaching new work, he can clearly see that the learners has already studied this and there is a certain perception and foundation already as far as the new work is concerned and that helps a lot. Grade 12s, well done on that. Well done on working during the lockdown. Well done on, on coming prepared, most of you. Unfortunately, not everybody, but we have called those parents whom we felt we the learners didn't do what they needed to do during the lockdown. But to the rest, as I've said, fantastic, well done, and thank you for that. Dear parents, we're leaving no stone unturned to make it as safe as possible for our kids at school. Um, thank you, learners, for cooperating with us, with the staff. I know the rules are difficult. I know it's inconvenient even for myself to wear a mask the whole day. It's not ideal, but we have to do this. And grade 12s, you are fantastic. I can see you really make an effort as far as this is concerned. We have done a survey. I felt it would have been good actually to have school on this upcoming holiday on Tuesday. But only 52% of parents felt they would definitely send their kids to school that day. Therefore, there will be no school on Tuesday. We can't have, have only half the kids here. A, a bit disappointing for me, but I also understand, and perhaps we all need the day of rest, the grade 12s after the long days, and the staff surely need a day of rest. The parents, you have noticed the new calendar as sent through by the Department of Education. Obviously, the 16th now is one day of rest. Then in August, there are actually two days of rest. So that's a long weekend, and that will be on the 10th and 11th of August, which will give us a nice break midterm. Then schools will only close, as I thought would actually be best, so that we don't have holiday at the end of June, July, as previously proclaimed. But there will be a week and a half holidays after the prelims has finished just before the 24th of September, which is a holiday, I think it's Heritage Day, and then school will start the next Monday after that, in other words, about a week and a half. That will be, that will be well worth uh, that stage. After the holidays, the learners will come back, finals uh, will be on our door, and learners will then have the final opportunity to be at school, to go through the exam papers of the prelims, acquire new knowledge, to get additional teaching, to master the things they couldn't during the prelim examinations, and then really be prepared for the final exams. We will let you know what those dates are the moment we receive the mentioned dates from the Department of Education. The appearance, but today, just a big thank you from my side. Things are going really well. The learners are behaving fantastic, right? Well, you're just a fantastic group. And for all the encouragement and for all the cooperation from the parents, I dearly thank you for that. To the rest of the school, I have applied that we allow the rest of the school, all the grades, grade 8 to 11, 
back to school as from some way next week or the latest the next Monday. Some information will follow regarding this as soon as I get an answer from the GDE. So we are anxiously awaiting the return of all learners to school. At Roosevelt High School, this will happen before other schools actually um, welcome their learners back at school. In the meantime, the other grades, do what you need to do at home and come back prepared as the grade 12s when you are allowed back at school. Dear parents, have a good weekend. Have a good rest day on Tuesday and I will speak to you soon. Blessings. Thank you.